Hey, so this is the uh, 2024 Ionic 6 SE standard range. This is my current state on the vehicle. You can see it's done 184 miles. Uh, it says it has 65 miles range left or 66 and 26% uh, of the battery left. So just as a reminder, this is a 53 kilowatt hour battery in this vehicle and we are averaging five miles per kilowatt hour on this particular drive, which has been a mix of highway and city uh, but more city in this case, I would say. Uh, and now we're gonna charge it up. We are at an Electrify America, 350 kilowatt charger. And uh, I'm gonna plug it in and get started and I'll come back. So just started charging. And you can see the power delivery ramping up pretty rapidly. 74, 81, 83, 90. Seems to have peaked at around 160, now it's backing off a little bit. Currently 837. Let's see if we do get up to 80% in 21 months. We seem to be hovering around just under 130 kilowatts at this point. Just to check in, it's down to 101 kilowatts at around 50% now, and the time is 842. Here's a view of the charger itself. There's nine minutes left till 80%. Here's another check-in real quick. I gotta say the power's been fluctuating all over the place. It dropped down to 70 kilowatts a while ago. Now it's back up to 120 and now it's, back, now it's dropping back down. And I don't think it's following any kind of curve seems pretty random at the moment. I don't know if that's the station or the car. Probably the station. So here we're at close to 80%. Power's down to about 80 kilowatts. I think that's roughly a good estimate for the time. I think it actually came in earlier than expected. So, pretty good charging overall, even though the charge curve and the charge delivery was fairly erratic, it's still completed 80% in a pretty good period of time. I have to go back and see exactly what the time was and I'll put down the exact uh, time elapsed.